it is time. It is time to brew your best beer. Brought to you by Beer Grains Supply Company, BrewTubers Online Brewers Club, Brew UK, Panhead Brewery, Tanner Ritchie, Finney's Homebrew Emporium, Brig Selve, Hackney Brewery, Hashigo Saki, Mangrove Jacks, Sprig and Fern Tavern, Yakima Valley Hops. Hi guys, and welcome to the 2014 SJ4 Challenge. Today, I'm going to review the Seraki Saison. Beautiful looking label. It's 6.5%. Uh, the registration number is RI179GB. Uh, it's got a nice Chinese or Japan sort of feel to it. It's got beer, beer, Darkol, beer, cerveza, malted barley, hops, yeast, water. There you go. Been looking forward to this one. I've never had a saison before. Let's crack her open. Lovely hair, lovely smoke. Right. Let's give this a pour. Oh, it's a bit fizzy. It's really fizzy. Right. What I'll do is I'll cut it there and I'll sort this out. Right then guys, I'm back. I'll sort it all out. Right then. It's well carbonated. Parents, beautiful, sort of nearly clear. Very pale coloured. Shows off my um, glass quite nicely. Right, so let's go for the aroma. It's got, it's definitely got an aroma, but not picking up what it is. Right. But appearance wise, like we just said, uh one finger um head on it now. It's very carbonated. You can make out those bubbles yet. Yeah. Um the head's not too bad. Apart from earlier when I opened it. Right. Let's dive in then. And it's quite different. I've never had something like this before. I am smelling a a sort of lot like an off flavour. I smelt it before on some of my brews. Not too sure what it is, but it definitely shouldn't be there. Yeah, the taste sort of sort of multi multi. I would say vinegary, malty, vinegary, and fizzy. Well, I'm not saying that um, the vinegar taste is horrible. It's it, it's not horrible. It's just that's what sort of is like a hint of vinegar. Right. Yeah. So I don't know what beer it is. I don't know what star colours. Uh, it's supposed to be a cerveza. 
Um, so base is really light and easy to drink. This is not that easy to drink. Right, okay, yeah. The flavours, not too bad. Just got some flavours in there that I'm not too sure about because of the ingredients. Now, Phil. I would say that's sort of thick on the taste. Um, not thick to drink, but it's just it's feeling a bit thick. It's not. It's definitely not thin. It's definitely not medium. It's it's more than that. Probably makes that a difficult drink to actually drink in, like as a session beer. Um, now that it's died down, it sort of looks like a lager uh, with the carbonation. There's a lot of bubbles in there, but doesn't taste like a lager. <coughs> carbonation attack. Yep, there's carbonate. There's, there's definitely carbonated in it. It's going to be very hard to judge. It's not warm. I don't get any warmth down there. Um, it's not smooth to the taste. It's sort of fizzy, rough, fizzy, if you get what I mean. It sort of reminds me, it being Japanese, uh, I don't know why it's going to remind me of that, only because it, because it looks foreign. Um, it reminds me of like when you're having a curry at the um, local Indian and they give you cobra or whatever they got. Um, don't get me wrong, there's nothing wrong with those beers, but it, it sort of tastes along those lines. For me, anyway. It definitely doesn't taste English. Let's put it that way. And it definitely don't taste like an American IPA. Um, a Saison, like a, I don't know what Saison is. I've never had one before. Um, this is what a Saison is. Um, I probably won't rush out to go and get one again but um, that's only because I like different styles it's got nothing to do with this beer it's quite a nice beer it's a nice color it's clearing up a little bit it's got a slight off sort of smell but that could be what Saison smells like so I'm not gonna mark you down a point for that no way there's no point Now that I'm getting to the end, it's I can taste some maltiness to it, and there are some nice flavours coming out of it, actually. So this is like a turnaround, and it's what six point five percent. So this is, <laughs> it's got to be a grower. This is a grower, not a shower. Mm, yeah. So overall, first appearance, uh, it didn't pour very well. Um, but, and I thought there was like off flavours. Uh, but to be honest, I don't think there is. It's, it's quite a nice beer, actually, to tell you the truth. It's better than some of the beers I've been drinking in this competition so yeah it's nice that's what I reckon 
and I think you can tell that it's quite nice by how much I've drunk. <sighs> ah. <coughs> Carbonation attack again. Just trying to see if I can pick up, make up any any of the flavours in there, but I don't know. The ingredients, it doesn't say on the website as well. I think all I'm getting is have a quick look. No, it doesn't say brewers, ingredients, nothing. Um, it's just beer, beer and sparkle. Maybe I should have looked them up before I tried this, but... Oh well. Anyway. Right, cheers for entering this. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, I came on drinking this and see if I can get any more flavours out of this. But yeah, one more to go. That's it. Right, see you in the next one, guys.